How to Replace Recoder Short Cord in Lisa Pro. Hello! Today we will go through the process of replacing the recoder short cord. In order to replace the recoder short cord, you will need recoder short cord, 2 mm hex key. Let's begin. Open the printer to get access to the recoder. Turn off the printer. Remember you are able to move the recoder arm manually. Remove the black recoder cover. Unscrew the four screws and pull out the plate. Grab the cord from both sides and remove it from the knurled roller wheel. Then, drag out the plate above the recoder's roller. Be careful not to touch the roller. Remove the second plate from the printer. Take your new recoder cord and stretch it in your hands before mounting. If the recoder arm in the printer has two aluminum blocks on both sides and stainless steel bushings, it means that the cord tensioner has been mounted on the overflow bin side. Otherwise, if the recoder does not have these features, the cord tensioner should be mounted on the other side. Mount the plate with the spring on the appropriate side and screw four bolts back. Tighten the screws. Take the other cord's ending and drag the plate above the recoder's roller carefully. Weave the cord in the roller's tracing wheel. It may help to lift the recoder's arm a little. Mount the second plate. Tighten the screws on this side as well. Then, you can reinstall black cover. Move the recoder's arm gently to get access to the middle of the cord. Grab the cord and lift it up a little, two or three times. Well done! To learn more about Centret's products, visit our support page on centret.com or send a form.